Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So last week, as I posted, Microsoft started finalizing our next optional bug fix update for Windows 10, KB5041582, which is currently in preview and beta. And we are actually expecting that to start rolling out later today on the 27th of August. And at the end of the day, it was just a memory leak and a bug fix update. There were no official front-facing features. Now, that's what the changelog mentioned officially, because that video will be linked down below and in the end screen if you want more info. But unofficially, it seems that Microsoft could be working on new icons for Windows 10's settings page. And the new icons, which aren't available as yet because they are still a hidden feature that was spotted by Phantom of Earth once again over on X, can be enabled if you so wish with the third-party app Vive tool. Now, hidden features, as you may well know, um, are code that Microsoft could be working on internally, and some hidden features even make their way eventually down to the stable version as official features. And if we head over to an image provided by Phantom of Earth over on X, here we can see something interesting going on, where it is mentioned that the latest Windows 10 beta release preview update, which is build 19045.4842, also includes some visual changes for the banner at the top of the settings apps homepage, updated icons and sign in button. So at the top is the old and at the bottom here are the new. And here we can see if we just zoom in here a little bit, at the bottom which are the new hidden icons for Windows 10, everything's a lot more emphasizing the blue. Very similar to what we see over on Windows 11's overall theme. So um, very interesting that Microsoft could be thinking of bringing another um, kind of Windows 11 feature into Windows 10. And I have found um, in the comments that Microsoft um, has recently been injecting quite a lot of Windows 11 little tweaks and adjustments and features into Windows 10. And I have found that's been mixed, been met with a mixed review. I have found you either like kind of Microsoft injecting Windows 11 features into Windows 10 or you don't. But nonetheless, interesting that Windows 10, according to Microsoft, is ending official support next year in October, but they seem to be set on injecting and rolling out Windows 11 tweaks and adjustments. So there you have it. There's the updated icons. There's the um, sign-in button, which is more blue. OneDrive looking a little bit more material U than it is currently in Windows 10. There's Windows Update, your rewards, and web browsing. And that was spotted by Phantom of Earth over on X. So it's going to be interesting to see if these new so-called Windows 11 uh, blue icons, for want of a better word, are officially going to make their way into Windows 10. But I thought this was interesting and just wanted to keep you guys posted. And if this ever does happen officially, obviously, I'll let you guys know. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.